Hello my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing really really well. Today's video is another vlog, just a quick little one, but I got a tree. I'm so excited. So I finally got a tree. I feel like everyone else got a tree back in November, but the tree is real. So I didn't want it to die before Christmas. So I'm just hoping that it will be fine for what like three weeks ish i have put water in it so i mean i hope so i'm gonna show you what it looks like so here we have the tree it is not perfect but i really like how wide it is it takes up so much space though and honestly the best part about having a real tree is the smell it just smells so nice i cut off a few of the branches I had help cutting off a few of the branches all like at the bottom of the tree and I put them like around the house and they just smell so nice. I wanted to get like a nice ribbon for the tree because I think it looks so beautiful but we've never had it like in my family. We've never done it and they were sold out of like the nice wide ribbon things you can put on trees everywhere. So <clears throat> I ended up getting some really wide I think it's like a table runner and I'm just gonna cut it in half. It is really, really long. I'll see if it looks horrible. I mean, I could just take it off. And I also bought some lights to put on this tree, obviously. And I've either done something really stupid or kind of cute. So I got these. I'm gonna try to take them out. Like these kind of lights. And I feel like these are these were really popular when I was a kid, but obviously they had the wire and these are without the wire. So they just take a battery in and then you have a remote. I just feel like I have so many of the string lights all around everywhere else here, like around my TV and all my plants and the windows and everything. So I figured maybe it's cute to have these on the tree. So I'm gonna try to cut up this first. Could I just use it like that. Maybe that's nicer. Maybe I don't need to cut it up, actually. I don't actually think I need to cut it. As you can tell, it's like super long. in camera than it does in real life so that's that's great i probably should have gotten twice the amount of ribbon or runner <laughs> uh i don't know if this kind of just looks worse than what it did before i don't know i'm just gonna hurry up and put on some ornaments i'm just gonna ignore that that looks a little bit sad and i'm gonna move on and do these lights hopefully i got enough lights because i critically underestimated how much ribbon I needed but I just realized I have to put batteries into 40 of these so I'm just uh putting on Christmas music on my television and I'm just gonna spend however long it's gonna take me to fill 40 of these with batteries to put them on the tree and I didn't really think about this but they are a little bit heavy it's cute though like I think that's really cute and they also kind of make a bit of a decoration Definitely 
made the ribbon seem a little less, I don't know, lonely. So I can see that some of these I need to just like straighten up a little bit. They're looking a little bit askew. Yeah, I can probably go here for hours and do that <laughs> if I just obsess over it enough. I do love that there isn't any string here. Like they are just the lights. I, I think they look really pretty, but again, maybe it will look a little bit better once I get the ornaments on. kind of cold but you know you've got a hand to hold come along out and play what a wonderful day your white cheeks are so hard to resist and those red lips I don't know if you can actually see out the window it's gotten quite dark for some reason it looks brighter in camera uh it's probably really adjusted for the darkness, but I think I have most of the bubbles and everything on. I don't know, I still feel like maybe it looks a little bit empty. One thing though, I kind of impulsively just bought these ornament hooks, just because I couldn't see that they had any of the little strings. Hello, why have I ever hung ornaments without these? Why do I use the little string? It is so inconvenient. And then you have to like, push it onto the branches and they kind of poke you and it's just so uncomfortable and unnecessary and it takes so much longer. This was so easy and you can just hook it on wherever. Why did I ever do anything other than that? That is so genius. But can you see the top of that tree? Yes, you can. I don't think it should fit nicely onto it, or not. You can't even see it. There it is. <laughs> Why is that looking so incredibly strange? It's just kind of really tall. It makes me think of a chimney. I mean, I could cut this. Definitely let me know what you think. Should I cut it so I get that star sort of at a more reasonable height? All right, so I've uh, just had some food. I put a couple more things on the tree, but I think I'm gonna say I'm done here just because I'm probably gonna go forever if I don't. Definitely will consider doing something about the top here because it looks a little bit odd. I also just put some string lights on the floor here. I think once I get like some presents placed under here, it's gonna look a lot nicer. So while I was eating, I got a couple of deliveries and I just wanted to show you one thing or I wanted to unbox one thing. So I already have one of these and I was really annoyed that I didn't order more. I just ordered one because it sold out really quickly. So I had to get another one as soon as it came into stock. I, I still want more, but go so it is this really beautiful patchouli candle and it does smell really nice it wasn't too expensive either oh, I can't get this oh this was so difficult to do with one hand but this just smells really nice but mainly I just love this container that it comes in so I just really wanted to buy that as a little pot I think maybe I'm gonna use this as a brush holder I just thought it was beautiful and it has that super cool texture to it I just thought this was such a cool little piece I wanted to share it with you that was really the only exciting shareable thing that I got in deliveries so I'm not gonna share the rest, that's just boring. But I'm gonna go into town. It is quite late or it just looks really late because it's completely dark, but they're doing sort of a light show and it's supposed to be really pretty. So I'm gonna meet some family in town and we're gonna go have a look at it. So I'll take you along with me.
so I think there are supposed to be these booths are supposed to be open but like most of them are closed I think it's because it's kind of late but oh yeah That's my cue to shut up. I think I need one in my living room. on my balcony, maybe on my roof. I probably have my neighbors complaining, but my gosh, that would be really funny. This is kind of creepy. Oh well, I think I'm gonna go. Okay, so hopefully you could see some of that. I know it's really, really dark out, so it's probably not that easy to see, but there are some really, really nice lights. I thought they were so incredibly pretty. They just uh, display the lights on the church in town, and there are so many sort of other lights and holiday decorations. I just love it. And doing these small things that they don't have to take a lot of time or effort, it just really helps set the holiday mood for me. I just think it's really cozy. I'm just gonna get home and that is probably going to be it for today. It is quite late so I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you enjoyed it. Again let me know what you are doing to sort of set the holiday spirit for you and just thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye! In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good good time